Nigerian swimmer Akin Rodoye Samuel has swum nearly 12 kilometers to raise awareness of mental health issues in his country after a friend of his nearly took his own life due to depression. We are doing this too so that uh, people don't just think that suicide is the next line of option for them. Uh, they shouldn't think that it's the next line of option for them. Your life can actually change within a blink of an eye. So just make sure you stay alive to witness it. So no one should commit suicide again. Don't think of coming to the Todd Milan Bridge to jump in anymore. The swimming coach swam the length of the longest bridge in Lagos, where many people have jumped to their death. This Todd Milan Bridge has been very, very, uh, uh, has been known for a lot of suicide cases in the back, uh, back then, where people would just come at the end of the day, once they, once they think that, oh, they, 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 they're done with life, all they just do is come up here and just jump into the water. And this is just a campaign against that. The 2021 UNICEF report showed one in six Nigerians aged between 15 and 24 were depressed, anxious or had other mental health issues. Medical professionals say the stigma associated with mental health in Nigeria's culturally conservative society makes it difficult for people to open up.